the CLS. Um, why was the CLS so important for us? If you go 14 years back, uh, 2004, that's 14 years ago, we actually invented this segment of the four-door coupe. Well, what did we do? Well, we took all the design elements, all the emotional uh, styling elements of a coupe, we combined it with the functionality of a sedan, and here we go, we had a new segment, we created a four-door coupe, and we called it the CLS. And our first generation actually la launched in 2004, this was 14 years ago. We followed it with the second generation, and here today, you had the chance already to spend a couple hours, I guess, this morning in our third generation, which will launch later, late this year. So we are here, the third generation of our CLS, um, a segment which we invented. Let's take a really quick look at the car, beauty shot of that car. And I think there's a couple firsts which, which come with this car. Uh, the, the first is uh, the design language. This is kind of the first car which really showcases uh, our new design language, the new design interpretation. Gordon Wagner, our head of design, calls it sensual purity. Maybe another word or another way to describe it is, and I'm really quoting him again, uh, he says at one point, well, the time of the creases and edges are over. They're gone. And I think you really see that if you look at the car of the sideline, and he also said, and I love that one, if you can take away a line and you still like it, take, it, take away another one. That's his quote. And then I think that really summarizes the way he, de he, he develops this new sensual purity design execution. Really beautiful flowing sidelines uh, of that car, um, which just gives it um, a, a beautiful uh, look and, uh, you know, gone are the times with edges and, and contours counter running to each other in sidelines and really busy sidelines. So let's take a little look uh, on that car in the front. I mean, our, AM, uh, our CLS here in the United States has AMG cladding standard, and you see that perfectly in this shot. So you see the A-frame of the grill here with the diamond pattern with the single lamella, massive air intakes, then a continuation of kind of the typical AMG A-frame and the air intake in the center down there. If you walk down, if you look at the lights, these are very narrow shaped full LED lights on the sideline. I talked about that already. We have 19 inch wheel standard. Of course, the car has frameless doors like every generation of our CLS. And I think on the back, just a beauty shot here, we have two piece tail lamps, full LED tail lamps on the back and a really wide rear bumper, AMG sculpted rear bumper with integrated tail pipes just to round up uh, the uh, design of the rear of the car. And if you take a look uh, on the rear again, it's also an integrated spoiler to help to downforce, uh, to help to increase the downforce and the reaction of that car. So just some beautiful running shots on that car. Uh, let's move to the next slide here. Go to the interior. And I think this is just a stunning shot. I love that shot. It just really shows you this flowing muscle. I call it a muscle of this wood trim piece which stretches really from all the way from one door to the other and you have these these almost these are these are art pieces of, of air vents here they are turbine style air vents for for and right in the center here um, and then the next thing obviously you, you'll notice we have our standard command screen it's a 12.3 inch command screen an optional additional 12.3 screen and if you have that, they're bonded together with the, and that they give, will give you this, we call it a surfboard, two massive 12.3 inch LED screens. And the steering wheel might be something you recognize out of the S-Class, that's our latest three-spoke steering wheel. Um, you have the, the touch control buttons integrated in the steering wheel and we also relocated our uh, stock for the cruise control now into the steering wheel functions right here on the left side. So you probably tried that this morning already. So beauty shot on the interior, we'll talk about uh, the leather uh, and other features in a second. But something I really want to show you as well, uh, so far, the first two generations, we had a four-seater. But with our third generation, all CLSs are standard five-seaters. So uh, take a look in the back seat, there's actually three seats now, so all CLSs have more space, <coughs> now uh, more uh, space in the back of the car. Talking about space, the overall <coughs> length of the car actually grew by two inches. The wheelbase actually by two and a half inches. And that helped us uh, to push the wheels even further out into the corners, you know, which further accentuates the sporty coupe style uh, looking of that car. Uh, legroom in the rear, 
uh, also benefited by the uh, longer wheelbase, uh, almost over half inch more legroom in the, in the rear of our five seater. Um, another feature, standard 64 color ambient lighting on that car. And we integrated now the function of the ambient lighting also into these air vents, which I described earlier. So they are illuminated depending on the color you pick. And we took a picture here of an, another functionality which we integrated here. If you raise the temperature of your car, actually the uh, LED lights and the air vents turn red for a certain uh, period of time. And then you lower the temperature, they actually turn blue, just to give you also a visual feedback of the settings which you do in your car. And by the way, try it out, you can actually also do that by a voice command. So you can push the button on the steering wheel, voice command button, and tell the car, raise the temperature by one degree, whatever, or set the temperature to 72 degrees. And then the car does uh, the, the command for you, and it actually gives you also feedback in terms of a color choice. So I think that's a very neat feature, especially if you uh, check that out at night. Talking about uh, very nice features, uh, in case you want to treat yourself on the way back to the hotel, uh, we integrated a function which is available on our CLS, we call it Energizing Comfort. And what we did here is, uh, we actually turned the car almost into spa on wheels. We offer now six predefined programs, they're each 10 minutes long, and we combined certain functionalities of the car into these uh, programs. So we used air conditioning uh, functions, uh, obviously uh, combine them with even the fragrance uh, which we have in the car to add some smell to the car. And uh, we use the seat functions of the car, you know, ventilated seats, heated seats, massage functions of the car, and all the uh, color um, features we, had, we have in the car, the 64 colors. And that we bundle that together depending on the mood you're in. And you can select either the package Joy or you select uh, Energize, whatever different feature you mood you're in. That's the one you should activate and try it. And the car treats you then with all of these different uh, stimulations around you. So uh, we're working on it that the car actually detects your mood uh, and automatically selects then the package, but that'll be probably the next generation. So let's talk about um, other features which are obviously standard in all of our latest uh, developments of our cars, all the intelligent drive uh, features which you are familiar with from our S-Class, from our latest E-Class technology, are now also uh, available and uh, in a standard in our um, CLS. So um, depending on uh, the package you uh, choose, we have um, all these active um, features uh, available in the car, active steering assist, speed link assist, I'm going to go through them. Most of them are uh, activated in the car and you might have experienced them or, uh, as well. Maybe one I want to call out here because that's something which uh, is, is we're very proud of is the pre-safe impulse side. I hope you don't experience it because that feature will actually uh, push you towards the center of the car in case the car senses an impending side impact. And it does so by inflating the side bolster uh, on the outside of the car and just move your body away from the door. So that's something which uh, is also now available in our all new CLS. Uh, but the other first uh, I'd like to talk about on our CLS is the return of the inline six cylinder. And it's a very special six cylinder. Uh, we, we actually looked it up, I had to look it up, it's 20 years ago that Mercedes offered a six cylinder, it was the S class, the S320, 20 years ago. This is the last six cylinder, inline six cylinder which we had on the market and we're returning now with a very special six cylinder. Uh, modern technology, it'll be the first ever uh, in the United States with a technology which we call integrated starter generation, I'll talk about that in a second. You see the stats right here, uh, our six, it's a three liter six cylinder, turbo six cylinder, it, it puts out 362 horsepower and gives you 369 pound feet of torque. Acceleration numbers are right here, 5.1 seconds for the rear wheel drive and even faster for our all wheel driven version, under five seconds, so 4.8 seconds. Now what makes that engine so special is a first. This is the first car in the United States stage which comes with this 48 volt technology and we call it an integrated starter generator. It's basically a small electric motor which is mounted in between the engine and the transmission. 
And what, what that um, starter generator, what this little um, electric motor does, it actually does a couple of things for you. It is more efficient for you in, in terms of fuel economy. It also gives you more power. You see here, it's up to 21 horsepower of boost, which this electric little uh, engine will um, help you out, especially before the turbo kicks in, so it helps you accelerate out of the get-go. Um, and it gives you also more torque, um, roughly up to 184 pound-foot of additional torque. These numbers are in addition, depending on the, the situation you're driving in, in addition to the numbers uh, which I showed you earlier. So, a couple of things, advantages of this uh, technology. A seamless start and stop technology. Um, you probably noticed that already. Um, also more comfort of the car, better efficiency of the car, and obviously more power, more uh, support when you accelerate. So, this technology has one other advantage uh, which helps you in efficiency. It has this gliding mode. I'm not sure the car uh, you drove so far went into gliding mode. You have to be in the echo. Uh, setting and you have to have start stop activated then when you are um, like on a downhill getting taking off the gas pedal the, actually all the dots go to zero the engine shuts off while you are driving we call that the gliding mode and an instrument uh, comes up and it says gliding mode and this is basically um, huge fuel savings for you while the car is driving based uh, powered by the 48 volt uh, battery back up here so make sure you try that out. Uh, it's another technology which is, which is first and comes with our CLS, with our uh, 450 uh, engine. So um, standard equipment, I mentioned it earlier already. We have 19 inch wheel standards. Uh, we have leather up upholstery, obviously standard. Uh, command navigation is standard with the big screen. Um, we have the sunroof standard, keyless starter standard, and, uh, and, and, and on some of the pre-safety features I listed earlier, all come standard with our uh, new CLS uh, generation here. This is US spec. Uh, European cars might be less lower spec, especially German cars. So US cars are typically very well equipped here. So now, of course, uh, we won't stop here. AMG also put its finishing touches on our CLS and you might already be familiar with the 53 nomenclature. We introduced that on the E-Coupe and in the E-Cab. And it's also coming, this technology and this engine is coming on the CLS. We call it a CLS 53. And that also is taking this inline 3-liter turbo engine, but AMG actually puts a little magic on it and they added an electric auxiliary compressor. And what this compressor does, it actually spools up your turbo until the turbo gets charged by the exhaust. So you won't have any lag from the turbo until it actually would kick in because uh, AMG has this little uh, compressor to actually boost the turbo. So you are, uh, from the get-go, you have your 429 horsepower and the 384 pound-foot of torque available. And that even uh, cuts down the 0 to 60 time on our uh, AMG, the E53, to 4.4 <coughs> seconds. That's a tremendous number here. Uh, of course, this engine also has our EQ Boost, the integrated start generator standard, and that adds again up to 21 horsepower and, as I mentioned earlier, a tremendous torque of uh, almost 184 pound-foot of torque in addition to these numbers. So, um, standard also on all of our AMGs, which help you to, uh, to achieve these 4.4 seconds, 0 to 60, is the Formatic Plus all-wheel drive system. That's a system which is fully variable torque, uh, fully variable torque uh, um, uh, movement between front and rear axle. You are familiar with that technology from our E63 um, sedan, and that is the same technology which is now standard on all of our E53 uh, CLS 53 AMGs. Um, now, interior shot. Um, just a couple highlights on our AMG treatment here. I think the first thing you'll notice are these massive side bolsters on our AMG Sport Seat for uh, superior side support when you uh, corner with that car. Then we have an AMG flat bottom steering wheel, which is standard on the car, and both 12.3 inch screens are standard on the AMG. This car also shows an optional carbon trim um, uh, treatment, which uh, you can select on, on our CLS 53s. So, I think um, we'll bring that already to uh, a summary here. So, what we'd really like you to remember when you walk out of here, we have three variants. We have a CLS 450, 
a Fomatic version of that, the CLS450 Fomatic, and an AMG, which is the CLS53, which is also Fomatic Plus standard on that car. We will launch that car late in 2018, late this year as a 2019 model year. Now, another thing is, it's not just beautiful, but it has a lot of brains. We talked a lot of, about a lot of things. We invented that segment, but we also bring back an inline six cylinder again. And that inline six has a first ever technology from Mercedes in the US. It's the integrated starter generator. We call it the Echo Boost. And another first on that car, it's a five seater now. So you can bring on your friends with you. Um, and uh, with that, I think that sums up our beautiful new CLS. I hope you enjoy your ride back. Make sure to try out some of these features I described. Treat yourself to a little spa treatment on the way back and try the gliding function. Okay, with that, thank you, and I'm heading back to Rob. Okay, thank you, Bernie.